PDM. Great win. PDM. Great win. PDM. Your Excellency. I still cannot explain how I feel today. But I thank all of you. I thank you all. The joy in my heart is abundant. So I thank you for ensuring that we won yes. in that keenly contested party primaries this morning. We won. Yes. <laughs> but I want us to remember that our victory this morning it's not ours alone. Mm. It is the victory of the masses. Mm. 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 Therefore, we must continue to work hard. Mm. We will work hard because there's a bigger battle ahead. Mm. Mm. Yes. Yes. Mm. And we will not stop until we have captured the number one seat in this state. Yes. It is only then that we can talk about total victory. Mm. <laughs> so I thank all of you. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Each and every one of you played your part excellently. Mm. Thank and you. That's thank why you. we won. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I thank all of you. Honorable okay. <laughs> Namdi. I saw your hand. <laughs> <laughs> Honorable Victor. <laughs> My governor to me. <laughs> well done. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Honorable Akachuku. <laughs> I saw you too. I saw you. And the women. Our women. Oh. <laughs> Our women. <laughs> women. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yeah. Daddy, you are the people's mandate. Yes, <laughs> sir. <laughs> and the governor to me. I am the happiest person on earth today. Mm. The victory is a great milestone in our push towards taking over the seat of power. Mm. It tells us that we are close to our dreams. Mm. Exactly. exactly. But we just have to take our destiny in our hands. Mm. Exactly. True talk. As we rejoice, let us bear it in mind that the battle has just begun. Mm, thank you. Nice. Nice. Talk. Nice. Talk. Nice. Talk. PDM. Very PDM. Very Sir. Good afternoon, Dad. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Good, good. Sorry I took so much time with my meeting. No problem, sir. Okay. Um, I guess this is uh, Amanda you told me about. Ah, yes, Dad. Um, Amanda here is an engineer by qualification and um, an intelligence guru by profession. And uh, Dad, each time I tease her, I call her an Intel commerciante. I have explained the nitty gritty of what we wanted to do for you while under your employ. And um, she's quite at home with every detail of it. I've told her she's going to work as a spy as you pursue your gubernatorial ambition. Okay, okay. All right. So, Amanda, you're welcome. Thank you very much, sir. Welcome. Um, honey? I hope you are comfortable with the arrangement. Yes, I am. Okay, good, good. All right, I will see you later. I have to meet with the party elders now. It's all okay, good, sir. Yeah. See? I told the you. The so nice. I told you.
ladies and gentlemen i'm sure uh, by tomorrow we shall have a fuller house mm -hmm. um, so that um please make sure the sharon hall is very well decorated okay sure. we shall be meeting at the sharon hall part of the government house tomorrow sure. because we will be welcoming our National Party Chairman. Oh, I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> and other State Party Chairman and uh, big party stalwarts of our party. Mm. All coming from different parts of the country. So, ladies and gentlemen, you can see that the importance of this urgent meeting cannot be overemphasized. <laughs> Your Excellency, my amiable governor, standing on existing protocols. I wish to thank all of us here for a job well done. I know there were times we disagreed just to agree, but now we have reaped the fruit of our labor. At least I won the primaries. No, I mean, we all won the primaries. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yes, despite all that have been said about our amiable governor here, mm -hmm. by some agreed members of our great party, it is work in progress. Yes. We yes. must win the main election coming soon. Must. By hook or by crook. Yes. The opposition must be crushed. ARD. Power, Power to the nation. ARD. Power to the nation. ARD. Power to the nation. I like that. My people, this development is an excellent one. Oh, sir. Dr. Peter G. For you to have listened to the pleas of your people and have accepted to go against your wish to run for the number one seat of this great states we thank you especially on behalf of my family and my people may god grant you the victory your highness i thank you and everyone here today for everything that happened here today I'm grateful uh, for the truth I know what my people want from me yeah as an independent candidate the tax ahead of me is an enormous one but I'm confident with all of you behind me, the victory is sure. Oh. <laughs> Your Highness, I shall make my statewide declaration by Monday morning. Don't <laughs> 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 Transfer five million naira to your account. Good. In a similar development, a man of God, Dr. Peter Oji, who is a first-class philanthropist and the founder of the Peters Foundation, 
has officially declared his intention to contest for governor in the forthcoming gubernatorial election. But what baffles many people in different quarters is his decision to run for the post as an independent candidate without any party affiliations. <laughs> Can you imagine? Can you just imagine? Ordinary Peter. What is giving Peter the morale to dramatize? Why does he want to waste his hard earned money in governorship race? To crown it all, he's even coming out as an independent candidate. In which country? Nigeria. In which state? Abam. All right. Peter, we shall see. Peter. We shall see. This is a political matter. This is a political matter. The same politics is a dirty game. But no, politics is for the faithful. But no, politics is honorable. Mm -hmm. Emeka. Yes, Eve. We needed to see what I saw on TV today. What was that you saw? People have already started rallying on the streets for that day, both individually and collectively. Even before he officially declares the commencement of his campaign. <laughs> so happy. Mm -hmm. Eve, you know, that will obviously tell you that God's hand is in this project. I can't you. Yeah. I'm so happy. Ah. Well, thank you. Sure. Thank you so much. This is a political matter. This is a political matter. The same politics is a dirty game. Man of God. Yes, I see. I love you so much. I'm a big, huge fan of yours. In fact, I have followed your works. Well, you see, your charity works oftentimes leaves me wondering what the state would have been if we had three people like you. Thank you. Yeah, three people like you. Thank you. You will do me a big favor. Please, I beg of you. I want you to withdraw from the gubernatorial race. I will offer you three billion naira if you do. Or, better still, talk to Mr. President. Of course, you know how close I am with him to offer you a ministerial appointment. The President and I, you know, Despite the fact that we belong to the same political party, we've been very, very close friends. I thank you once again, Your Excellency, for the offer. I appreciate. Um, but with due respect, sir, uh, I'm sorry. I've made up my mind. I can't take the offer. I'm sorry. I beg to take my leave. God bless you, sir. This is a political matter. This is a political matter. The same politics is a dirty game. But no, politics is for the faithful. But no, politics is honorable. My humble opinion on this is the mind of the people I led in Iraq. And it's a good thing my counterpart in North America, Prof. Levinus, had earlier said the same thing. I appreciate all the contributions I've made so far, especially the achievement of the team that can face or withstand the ruling party 
and the Metro Opposition Party, DPM. Therefore, I, I wish to say I have agreed to bend the initial registrant of royal as independent candidate. But my question is this: Did we register a new political party, or do we settle with the existing ones? Well, um, registering a new political party for now is out of picture. From my own perspective, what we need to do now as a matter of urgency is set up a committee which will have its members drawn from those of us in diaspora and those in Nigeria. Uh, this committee shall horridly compare and contrast the ideologies of uh, some of the already existing political parties and come out uh, with the best that represents uh, what we really want. That's okay. Yeah, look, I think that's exactly what we're gonna do. This is a political matter. Kingsley, listen to me very carefully. On no account must anyone know my hotel room. Nobody. I mean, nobody must make us fail, not even your father. I let you know here, just because of your insistence. It's never part of my business to let my clients know where I reside, okay? Um, it's all good, Amanda. You know what? In my mind, I see you and I closer than just ordinary friends. You see, I believe we have gone past that level and we are sweethearts, if you permit me to say that. <laughs> Don't forget we were classmates way back in the university. And um, I can remember a deal I gave to you of which you executed perfectly well for Alaji Omaru, that senator. <laughs> yes, I know. But you just have to understand that we are not age mates. This part we are classmates. I am older than you. <laughs> if I say you're funny, don't think I'm getting it wrong, okay? Um, I wouldn't doubt the fact you're older than me, though I've not confirmed that. But um, don't forget we are close friends. Yes, that's what we are. I hope you're not feeling bad. Why would I? You send the truth, for heaven's sake, so why should I feel bad? Good. Oh. Pass this on to your father. Tell him that work starts tomorrow, okay? Okay, um, no problems. I beg to leave. Oh. Kingsley, you're welcome. Sit. God bless you. I thought you would keep me waiting. Keeping to time is part of my personal orientation. You came without your guards. Your safety should be your priority number one, Kingsley. Well, um, my coming alone to this place does not make me a bit unsafe, and you know that. All right. Straight to the business of the day. My childhood friend. The last time we had a meeting as my old time friend was when I heard that your father was nursing the ambition to run for governorship. Despite our agreements, you promised to terminate that ambition. What happened? Well, um, it's so good you can remember we were old time friends. And that alludes you the information my personal orientation has got it to say, K Sarah, Sarah. What will be will surely be. 
So, if my coming here has got anything to do with what you are saying, I'm sorry, nothing is going to change. Trust me. That means I am left with no option than to deal with him. Anybody that stands against my father's candidate automatically is against me and you know what that means. Um, with all due respect, Honorable Collins, I would like to wait and see what the result becomes. So, I beg to leave. Oh. King Sule. Only a fool dares a lion, dead or alive. You have the information. I am not a fool. Can I live now? Have a nice day. This is a political matter. This is a political matter. The same politics is a dirty game. But no, politics is for the faithful. But no, politics is honorable. But no, politics yeah. is truthful. It's done. Just wait for me at the street adjacent to shop right. I'll be right there. Honorable Vincent. Your Excellency. I, uh, you are the state party chairman. And um, I presume that you know what it takes for a party to lose an election. So please, I want you to employ everything, or I beg of you with everything you hold dear to your heart, to employ everything you know you can to ensure that we not only win the election, but that we install Dr. Maxwell, the next governor of the state. Your Excellency, I intend to plug all the loopholes and do all those things I'm supposed to do, and do them on time too. In fact, Your Excellency, I intend to employ all the machineries on ground so that we come out victorious at the end. Good. Secondly, I want Dr. Peter Orji killed. And I want the killing orchestrated in such a very careful and highly technical way. As a matter of fact, I want it done outside my state. I don't want anything traced to us. Yes, Your Excellency. Consider it done. Good. And then finally, I want you to muster from wherever. I don't care the source. About 500,000 fake voters called. We need it for whatever. I'm sure you know what. I don't want to mention yeah. what we need it for. You know what? Yes, Your yeah, Excellency. Yes, I know. Let it be ready before the elections, okay? And uh, it will be done just as you wanted. 
Well, gentlemen and uh, lady, I guess uh, we're okay with this. Oh, it's, very happy. Very happy, Your Excellency. As a matter of fact, this is why I invited us here. Dr. Maxwell. Your Excellency. I'm sure you I'm sure you're happy now. Oh I am I am happy, Your Excellency. Thank you very much. The new matter. This is a political matter. Professor Zifajika and living us. Doc. I appreciate your effort so far. Thank you. God will bless you and all our people in Europe working with you. God will bless you. You see? Bless you too. It's not easy tax. Traveling all the time, Nigeria to overseas, just to make sure I become the next government of Abam State. <laughs> I say once again, God bless you. You're yeah, welcome, Doc. <laughs> Doc, this time around, we in diaspora want to assure you that we have mapped out enough funds to take good care of your campaign activities. <laughs> um, again, on the issue of um, security network, we want your fears on that to be addressed. Because we have planned to look for high profile security personnel to ensure your security is optimal. Thank you again. I'm most grateful. You're welcome. You're welcome. Our governor to be, please feel free. Apart from what we said, I've been sure. If there is any other thing you need from us, don't hesitate to let us know. No problem, Professor. In terms of security, I want to use the pastors and prayer warriors to do the job. Prayers, not gone. My ultimate weapon is the blood of Jesus Christ, the blood of the Lamb that speaketh more better things than the blood of Abel. That's my weapon. It's all right. Well, right. if you say so, there's no problem. Whatever is written is written. Whatever is written is written.
Elsa, o que ele É pior, o que ele 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 Excellency, great job, well done. Thank you very much. You are my backbone. Great job, well done. Yes. I can always count on you. I'm always loyal. The master strategist. <laughs> always. That's you. Okay. Thank so, you. Thank you. I told you. Yeah. Come here. Come here. I told you. <laughs> that was great. That was great. You Thank know, you. when he was going to be removed, I insisted that he stays yes. because I saw something that nobody saw. <laughs> Here we are. Yes. Give it to me. Thank you, sir. My party chairman, it is well. My governor, okay? You've done your part. Thank you. Leave the rest of You are okay. my backbone. You are I'm always loyal. Please, sir. Come here. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Sit down, sit down. I will buy you a new shoe. My party chairman, give it to me. Your Excellency. You've done well. Your Excellency. Ayo, 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 ayo